Hey everybody, welcome back to that series of Piper's Guide. I'm Martin. And I'm Derek. D-Man, what do we got on the topic for today? Man, I've just been using this old pink lighter here, and I'm just curious if there's a, a better way to light my pipe, because it's just, just not very distinguished. That was one heck of a flame, too. I, <laughs> I'm very happy that you didn't light yourself on fire. Okay. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's a great question. So, when lighting a pipe, there are a few methods that are okay, and there's one method that's really, really not okay. Always consider the material of the pipe, whether it's briar, whether it's some type of other hardwood, meerschaum, synthetic, or even corn cob. The first thing you always want to make sure you're doing is using a soft flame. Now, there's multiple categories. A, you do have your Bic lighters or your regular convenience store lighters. You also have, for instance, your Zippo lighters. Many of these Zippo lighters come with what's called a pipe lighter insert. There will be a hole here, and so you can actually press this upon your pipe and suck the flame straight down. Those are also very nice. The other is regular matches. Matches are never a problem. They're very handy. They're very good to use. And then you even have cedar that you can find at a lot of cigar bars or smoke shops. Those are also available as well. Something to note when it comes to your matches and your Zippo lighters is consuming what comes off of these in the initial burn process. If you decide to use matches, make sure you allow your matches to burn for just a second or two to get that sulfur burnt off. It's not going to taste good when you're sucking that down in your pipe. Same thing is, is when you're using something with your lighter fluid that you would use in a Zippo lighter, light it. Let it burn for a second so you're not sucking down the fumes from the lighter. These are very important, and they're going to help you enjoy your pipe. The worst thing you could do is try to enjoy a pipe and suck down fumes that are going to make everything taste terrible and coat the tobacco in your pipe. Please be careful of ever using anything like, like a cigar lighter, like using a torch lighter. Do not use a torch lighter in any pipe you have you run the risk of severely damaging or even burning out a pipe you could crack meerschaum you could really scald any type of corn cob or burn through on your briar pipes stay away from your torch lighters when smoking a pipe cigar is fine pipes no that was a great topic Derek. thanks man i learned a lot probably not gonna give probably not gonna give up my uh my trusty dusty pink lighter but it's good to have options i mean you got one heck of a one heck of a bowl that you could like <laughs> that with there is one other alternative when you're using certain lighters there are lighters that have a soft flame that are actually spigoted out that actually have a directional way that they point the flame and those are really good especially with deep pipes because they will point down It'll help you get the soft flame into the blend that you're enjoying. Makes it a lot easier. You can find those at most major online retailers for pipe tobacco. They'll usually have those in stock. Don't forget, we go live every single Friday at 9 p.m. Eastern. We have a lot of original content. Like, share, and subscribe. Be a part of the Over a Pipe Nation. We have a lot of fun. I'm Martin. And I'm Derek. Don't forget to uh, ask any questions in the comments. We're always happy to answer. Great point. We'll see y'all later. <laughs>